I love it up here, man. Yeah. It's been a long time. For me to get outdoors, it's just the peace, the quiet. It doesn't matter whether or not I get birds. Just the exploration part of it, it rejuvenates me. It's good for the heart, good for the soul. Being born in, in Central America, from the country of Guatemala, hunting was just not something that you did down there. So when we came up here, hunting was brand new to my dad. The story goes that our neighbor was in the garage getting ready for a duck hunt. My dad walked over and said, what are you doing? And Tom explained to my dad that he was going to be going duck hunting. And a week later, my dad was out duck hunting. That piqued my interest and I started asking if I could tag along. And that's how I started. A lot of times it was just me and him driving around, looking for public lands looking for a place to hunt. So we just kind of explored the state of Kansas by ourselves. I've heard, well, you know, people don't have access to private land. I don't have private land. I hunt 99% exclusive public lands. Where, where was it at? Right in front of you guys. I just yep. heard it. I'm like, <laughs> Because of my curiosity, every hunting trip for me and for our group, it, it literally oh, is an adventure. I'd say it's a little one. It's definitely a, maybe an earlier hat. Bird. We've discovered so many places that I didn't know that Kansas had to offer, whether it's waterfalls or a big open golden fields or streams. Without going out and experiencing that, you're going to be missing a whole, whole lot of opportunity in a whole lot of different places. It doesn't have to be about hunting, it's just about exploring.